Welcome to our tech troubleshooting video. Today, we're addressing a frustrating issue that many developers encounter after upgrading their tools. One of our viewers recently upgraded to the new Xamarin for Visual Studio and is facing a peculiar problem. They can no longer hit breakpoints during iOS debugging while everything works perfectly for Android. Despite uninstalling and reinstalling Visual Studio Community Edition 2017 and trying various solutions found online, the issue persists. Let's dive into this challenge and explore potential solutions together. All right, guys, welcome back to another tech video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Now, don't forget to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you'll get to that resolution. Anyway, on to the video, cheers. First, let's check your project configuration. Ensure that your iOS project is set to use the correct build configuration. Next, verify that the debugger is properly attached to your iOS simulator or device. Sometimes the debugger may not connect automatically. If breakpoints are still not being hit, try cleaning and rebuilding your solution. This can resolve many issues related to stale builds. The Lastly, ensure that your Visual Studio and Xamarin tools are fully updated. Sometimes, updates can fix bugs related to debugging. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. If your breakpoints aren't being hit in Xamarin Forms for iOS, try disabling linking in your iOS project. This solution worked for me. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. If your breakpoints aren't hitting in Xamarin.Forms for iOS, there's a known bug in Xamarin.iOS. The fix is in version 10.12.12.12, available in the beta channel. This issue mainly affects portable class libraries. As a temporary workaround, switch your portable class library to output portable PDB files. You can do this by editing the project file and changing the debug type to portable. After making these changes, rebuild and deploy your iOS app. However, be aware that this may cause issues on Android. To resolve that, delete the bin and obby folders, uninstall the app, and clean and rebuild the solution. Keep in mind, even after these steps, some users still experience issues on Android, so it may not be a perfect solution. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To ensure your breakpoints are hit in Xamarin.Forms for iOS, open Visual Studio for Mac. Navigate to the Solution Explorer and select your project. Then go to Project, Options, Compiler, and set Debug Information to Full. Remember, you need to set this full option for each project in your solution that you want to debug. Otherwise, the breakpoints won't activate.
Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. If your breakpoints in Xamarin Forms for iOS are not being hit, check your binding context. Without it, breakpoints may show as symbols not loaded. Setting the binding context correctly, resolve the issue for this user. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. After extensive research, the user found a solution for the issue of breakpoints not being hit in Xamarin Forms on iOS. They recommend checking the attached screenshot for guidance. And that's it, guys. I hope this video helped find that resolution you're looking for. If it did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.